even if it's not alert, this is what you need to do. You just go here and then there's this add note button, all right? So you hit add note, you choose the date of when it happened. All right, so like, hey, I, I, uh, I'm I starting this, this campaign on this date. And then you put here under type, you just write what, like a brief thing of what it is. Like I could say, hey, uh, title change, you know, something like that, right? You can choose which product you're doing it on. And then you write all the notes that you want to up to like 100 characters, like with details of it. Like, hey, I changed my title to this. I switched this image from the second image to the third image, like whatever it is that you are doing. And then you save the note. And then you see these little dots here? What's going to happen is now your notes will show up here and your alerts. So like, for example, the, the, these are just tests. These are just test ones. Now I could see that on March 7th, I increase my PPC budget to $500, all right? Here's one that will show alerts. L look at all these five-star reviews I got on one day. On this one, this one shows my transfer status change. That, that was an alert, right? But you can see how it looks different when there's notes, all right? So now you go back in history and, you know, I, I could go back and say, hey, what's going on in the last 30 days? And then let's maybe go on my, some of my top products. And what eventually you're going to see is based on the top product, what is happening like right now? We don't have that, but that's what a future state is going to be. Those exact notes are now going to show up on the line of these products when it corresponds to an exact product. But right here on, on the revenue side, I could see all these little notes day by day. And so hopefully this actually inspires you guys to actually do more experiments, knowing that you can track a little bit better. Like what if I'm doing a look back, like think about this nine months from now, I'm looking back at my sales. I'm like, wow, look at this peak of sales I had on March 10th or in the week of March 10th. And I'm like, I don't remember what I did. Well, now you'll be able to go back and choose, you know, last year in March or something, and then look at your notes and like, oh yeah, I did that. Wow. That really worked. I need to do that again. All right. So that's something that's super cool.